Hello everybody, it's the JNJ Gamer here and today I'm going to be playing even more Hearthstone. Hope you enjoy and uh, yeah, let's get to it. So since the new season just started, I thought I should just try to rank up. So um, maybe this time I'll, I'll play a, a priest. As you can see, it's called a control priest. I, I don't know if it's an actual control priest anymore. It's just a, an old deck I had um, that I recently just switched some cards around. Uh, make it more viable, and I don't know, let's see what we can make with this deck, uh, hopefully, hopefully we're gonna get some wins, oh, we're going against a Priest right away, nah, not, a, not a bad first draw, uh, Death Lord, Shadow War Pain, and Power War Shield, uh, they're all pretty good, and I think I'm gonna keep all of them, um, kinda try to uh, get that Death Lord out as soon as possible, and, um, you know, Use the Power Wars shield to buff it up. Hopefully he's gonna drop his own Death Lord and we can uh, Shadow War paint it. Um, yeah. Come on, dude. Like, how long does it take to, to fucking mulligan some cards? And we get a Dark Cultist. That's, that's not bad. We don't have a turn 1 or turn 2 drop, but um, if he's gonna coin turn 2, well... If he's gonna coin something, we can Shadow War paint it. He doesn't. Still nothing we can do. Let's just do some some priesty bullshit. Just heal him up. And um let's see what he plays. Are you going to play a Death Lord? A lot of my cards are a pretty standard priest right now. Okay, so we're gonna go with the Death Lord, I think. Although he might have his own Shadow War Pain, and that might completely screw us up, but I don't know, the Dark Cultist. Should I go Dark Cultist instead of Death Lord? Yeah, maybe I should go Dark Cultist. As like a little bit of bait. That's that's just my mindset, you know, that's how I usually think like, hmm, maybe, you know, if I want a Shadow War Pain, maybe he can Shadow War Pain me, you know? And I don't want to. I don't want to do that. Okay, so we got a light spawn, which is um, very unfortunate for us. I think I'm gonna have to power war shield. If I power war shield, my dark cult is that gonna be six HP? So it's gonna be down to one. This guy is gonna be down to two. So I should be able to then just shadow war paint it. And I think this is what I'm going to do. And now I'm Shadow War painting it. And I'm gonna drop down the uh, North Shadow Cleric. Heal my guys up. Get a card. Kind of a nice starting combo. You know, we're, we're gonna see if that was a good move or a bad move on our part. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I'm not gonna regret uh, wasting that uh, Circle of Healing later. I do have a, I do have quite some AOE in this game. Another one. God damn it! This guy means business. Should I go Belcher or I don't think the Death Lord is a, it's a good solution against this light spawn. So I'm just gonna go Belcher and I'm gonna I'm gonna hit face. He's I know he's he can kill the Belcher, but even if he does do that. We can still probably then kill the lots the light spawn. This light spawns they're very they can be very dangerous if they they get buffed up. So if he has them, he probably has the thing that makes the attack equal to the HP. I don't remember how it's called. He probably has it in his deck. He probably has a bunch of things that he can use to to buff this guy's HP up, like he's probably gonna do now. Oh, just Veil is chosen. Okay, it's a nine nine. He's holy smiting my cleric. And now he's killing my Belcher. He's not killing the healing the light spawn though. I think. Or maybe he will. Circle of healing. Okay. That is a 9-9. Nine nine. <laughs> that is not good. A 9-9 nine nine is not not good. Oh god. There's no way we can kill him. Unless we draw a, a Shadow Word, Shadow Word Death here, or if we might control it turn ten, but you know it's there's it's a long way. 
We do not want to use the Death Lords because that is going to give him cards. Yeah, they are useless basically against the Light Spawn. So I'm, I'm just going to keep hitting face. And um, the, only, the only good strategy I can, I can uh, use now is just wait. Just wait and hope that, hope that we're going to get something we can use to, to kill that fucking thing. Can he kill this the slime with something else? Can he? Can he do face damage with the light spawn? Hopefully not. Let's get wow. Kodo Rider can be a big problem. Okay, we're gonna kill the Kodo hit the Kodo Rider. We can't kill it. And we're gonna heal up. We need to take that Kodo Rider up. Uh, the Inspire on it is just crazy. And he is going to get that ability because there was nothing I could do to prevent it. I really need some AoE. I really, really need my Light Bomb or, you know, Circle of Healing with the Alcanai Soul Priest. It's really the only thing that could save me right now. Because already I can see us losing that this match really quick. Oh my god, he's buffing it up. Oh, Jesus Christ. He's buffing it up. And we can't, still can't kill it. Still can't kill it. He has a war auto now. He's stunting that. Oh. Nasty situation we're in. Maybe we can get something. Mmm, we could, we could kill to Zod here. Ah, shit. If we could have killed this guy, then we could have get, gotten the, the buff on kill to Zod. But I don't think kill to Zod is a really good option right now. In this situation. So we, we can play the Storming Champion. We can buff it up. To at least kill that thing off. He's gonna get another one, but uh, s still, we just have to, to gain, get some time, you know, just, just drag it out and hope we, we get a light bomb and we can clear this mess up. I mean, the light bomb would will, will only kill the light spawn, really, but. Ugh. I gotta say, this guy has a really interesting... Oh, shit! He killed Hillard up, up to 9. And he is drawing cards. He's... We just... We just took 19 damage. Did we just lose? 18-18. Plus 2, plus... That's 13 damage that he can deal to us. 21 damage he can deal to us. 21 damage. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, fuck. We just gotta have to play the two Death Lords and hope they keep us alive. Hope is all we have left, really. Like, there's nothing left. At this moment, like, we we're at 11 HP. It's, it will be very easy for him to... Not something good. Oh, no, why the Elkanai Soul Priest? Why? Why the Elkanai Soul Priest? Are you afraid of the dark? Even if we draw Light Bomb right now, it still won't keep us alive. We still die. At least he can kill the Death Lord. <laughs> At least we got that. <laughs> He, that, this guy is crazy. What a good deck, I have to admit, this is an amazing deck. I, I All I can do is take this thing. There's really nothing else I could do. Um, and I guess I'm just gonna hit the cleric, but this is over. I am just gonna concede, give him the GG. Really bad start, but, but... I, I have a feeling that, you know, we, we have to lose 
in the beginning to be able to win. That doesn't make any sense. Let's try again. Let's try again. I'm sure, I am sure that this is going to get better. I'm sure that this game, this game winner will win. This game is going to be our game. We're going to just destroy this guy. Our deck is good. I mean, admittedly, that guy's deck was considerably better. We're going up against a rogue. This, this should go well. It's not, a, it's not a bad draw. Two dark cultists and a death lord. I, I'm gonna mulligan one of the dark cultists. Hopefully we're gonna get something, uh, you know, a little bit more variation. The vulture is a little bit high in mana. But it's fine, I guess. It's fine. This death lord will really be useful, I, I think, against the, um, the rogue. It's really gonna give us that, that shield we want against uh, a lot of face damage. He's not going to be able to do all his crazy combos and take out our stuff. Of course, nothing we can do this turn. We're just going to pass it and we're going to go turn to Death Lord, coin Death Lord. Uh, which is always a good move. He's just going Dagger Mastery. Okay. Let's just coin Death Lord. Death Lord on the field. Probably we're going to go Shadow or Pain. He's probably going to drop something down where we can... Uh, kill with Shadow of Pain, and then I'm gonna just power War Shield uh, the Death Lord. This seems like the best, best way to go. Come on! Backstabbing, and he's gonna follow up with. Okay! This guy, I don't know, what, what's his name? SI7 Agent? SI7 Agent, we're gonna kill this fucking thing. We're gonna buff up our Death Lord, draw a card, whoa, Shadow Word Death, always good to have in hand, just in case things get crazy and we need, uh, we need uh, some big removal. And yeah, let's, let's see what the, the Rogue has for us. He's buffing up Deadly po only one Deadly Potion. It's interesting, kind of seems a waste, you know, he used that Deadly Potion uh, to... What, why am I saying Potion? <laughs> Poison to buff up uh, a knife that was already used up. I'm gonna do this, heal up our Death Lord, we don't want the Death Lord to die, you know? You only want the Death Lord to die when you have full control of the board, because it's gonna give him another uh, a card, a free creature, and you do not want that. You do not want it at in any way. Okay, he's going, um, he's gonna get the plus one on his weapon, and now he's... Hmm, he's buffing up the auto barber. This same this deck seems to be very basic. A really basic deck, in my opinion. Uh, it, it's quite. It seems a little bit weird. Did I just fuck up? I think I just fucked up, guys. No, no, I didn't. I'm gonna kill this thing. Get. Oh no, I did fuck up. Ah, uh, why, why do I not pay more attention? Because I'm an idiot, that's why. I could have done it in such a way that I, this guy would have been at 3 HP right now instead of the uh, Pilot the Shredder. That's gonna die immediately. Uh, unfortunately, he's getting another creature for free here. That actually worked out great for us. That worked out perfectly for us, in fact. I am happy with that result. He, you know, I guess, I guess that is, uh, you know, if you have a lot of creatures that have battle cry, you know, the death floor can kind of fuck you, fuck your strategy a little bit. You know, because he missed, he missed the battle cry on that. So um, he's going send your shield master with uh, SI seven agent again. Uh, I'm gonna go Belcher and I'm gonna heal up my. Uh, guy here and I'm going to try and bring down this uh, Sentient Shield Master. Since the, like, the Sentient Shield Master is such a good card, such a good card always, but this guy seems to be playing a very basic deck. He seems to be playing something uh, that's not very, very complicated. A lot of basic cards in it. So um, our Shredder is dying this turn, unfortunately, but we do get... Uh, you know, the, the drop from the uh, Shredder. He's dropping a lot of shit on us. 
but I think I can very easily handle this. I'm going to... Hmm. What am I going to do? I could light bomb everything he has, and I think this is what I'm going to do. I'm gonna damage that a little bit. Kill everything, heal up, and um, we're gonna start having some fun next turn. We're gonna go Dark Cultist Sylvanas, he only has one card. That's why I light bombed, because he only has one card left. So um, I just could go Sylvanas and Dark Cultist. And then of course Keltzad follow up. Yep. I don't wanna play Yasera. I wanna play Yasera because I have Keltzad and uh, I wanna be... I want to um, have more creatures on the board, you know, they just won. What is that? Oh, Defias. Okay, the Defias bandits. That's fine, that's fine. He can only hit face, really. It would be stupid of him to hit, like, do anything else than hit face. But um, unfortunately for him, I'm sorry, my friend. We're just gonna have to go kill Zod and, you know, kind of... You know, kill, just basically kill everything you have. Yeah, I know. It's unfor it, it, Kill the Zod is such an annoying card, because now he basically lost, unless he can just... Oh, come on! He top deck assassinate! Bunch of bullshit! The, what the fuck? What the fuck? How, what are the chances to top deck assassinate when... I just dropped down Keltzad. Fuck you. At least I have Ysera. A bunch of bullshit. God damn it. Ugh. Yeah, give the fuck up. You lost. You lost when I dropped Keltzad down. You can't rely on top decking, you know? You can't.